When I addressed the nation last Sunday, there were over 160,000 confirmed COVID-19 cases worldwide. Today, there are over 340,000 confirmed cases across the world. In South Africa, the number of confirmed cases has increased sixfold in just eight days from 61 cases to 402 cases. The National Coronavirus Command Council has decided to enforce a nationwide lockdown for 21 days with effect from midnight on Thursday, the 26th of March. This is a decisive measure to save lives of South Africans from infection and save the lives of hundreds of thousands of our people. While this measure will have a considerable impact on people's livelihoods, on the life of our society and on our economy, the human cost of delaying this action would be far, far greater. The nationwide lockdown will be enacted in terms of the Disaster Management Act and will entail the following. From midnight on Thursday, 26th March, until midnight Thursday, the 16th of April, all South Africans will have to stay at home. I have accordingly directed the South African National Defense Force to be deployed to support the South African Police Service in ensuring that the measures we are announcing are implemented. South African citizens and residents arriving from high-risk countries will automatically be placed under quarantine for 14 days. Non-South Africans arriving on flights from high-risk country we prohibited a week ago will be turned back. International flights to Lanseria Airport will temporarily be suspended. International travelers who arrived in South Africa after 9th March 2020 from high-risk countries will be confined to their hotels until they have completed a 14-day period of quarantine. 